Hello, Genin, and welcome to Super Auto Patch. Today's gonna be a quick little session. We're just doing some fun little game that I've become addicted to. Nothing unusual. This game is quite interesting. Basically, it uses images from the animals that you would normally find in your phone. Uh, basically, emojis and text animals. And you have to build them into a team designed to take out the opposing team. And it can be quite an enjoyable time. Uh, now, it's also quite frustrating. I have never managed to get a full win, aka like 10 wins in a row, or just 10 wins in general. The most I've gotten is maybe 6 to 8, I think. But I'm pretty good at this game. Uh, and I really enjoy it. It's something quick and easy and fun that anybody can do. Now, because this is a frustrating game, there is a possibility that I might say something a little more nasty than usual. It isn't that I've been trying not to swear while I'm playing these games. It's mostly because I've trained myself not to swear whenever I don't feel the need to. Now, that having been said, I'll probably end up saying some kind of naughty word at some point in this game, but... I want you to know that that does not mean that I am not absolutely 100% fucking amazing. Alright, here we go. Okay, we got a fish. Fish are almost always good. I'm going to freeze the mosquito because I might be using that. Okay, mosquito it is. And we'll put the otter in. And of course it gave power to the wrong creature. Oh well. Let's end the turn and we get to choose our name. Wishy washy bikers, cliche pots, salty bits. I'm gonna go with the salty bits because it is the most questionable name that I can think of out of all of this. Alright, the untouched boogeyman. Wonderful. <laughs> oh well, that could have been a lot worse. Alright, we've got another fish. Always get to the favorite fish as soon as possible. An ant. A roll. And another ant. Yep, we'll take the ant. And we're gonna freeze the ant. Alright, this team is looking alright. Could be better. Salty Bits versus the Skilled sw Skaters. Okay, I got a pig. And the Skater targeted the one thing I really didn't want to target. Alright. Not looking too bad. I think we're going to do this. Or maybe we have a bad ant. Victory! Wonderful. Two two pets now. Hmm. Let's give the apple to the fish. Let's roll. And let's sell. No, no, no. Yeah, let's sell you. We get the elephant and peacock combo. Roll again. Save that fish. And I also want to freeze the honey and the apple. Just for safety. Alright, let's do this. The salty bits versus the unintended parts. Well played. And that fish is going to be a problem for me. Right down. Okay, let's upgrade that fish. That's going to be very helpful. We will get... Hmm. Yeah, let's get rid of the mosquito. And the sheep. And we'll also give... The 
Versus the exported teapots. Okay, elephants, do your thing. Okay, let me see. They're now a very powerful teapot, but it was eliminated in one turn. Okay, let us put the honey on that sheet. Next time, for the next round. What a victory! Wonderful! We're doing pretty good. But well, things are gonna get very hard very quickly. Okay, two peacocks. If I do that, let's get rid of the ant for the kangaroo. Oh, bison is always a good combination with fish. So, oh, except I don't have a level 3 friend right now. So we'll freeze you. Oh, oh giraffe, I want a giraffe. Oh, and we will end the turn. Okay, the salty bits versus the slippery beavers. That is an amazing name. Okay, that mouse is a problem. But, that fish is a problem. We're probably gonna lose this one. Change things up a bit. Let's get rid of the kangaroo for the giraffe. And I pick the giraffe a lot of the times just because of what's about to happen here. Giraffe. <laughs> so because a giraffe does not make a sound, they just say the word giraffe, which I find to be hilarious. Give you the honey to and we will roll again. Sure, we'll buy another piece. Okay, I'm gonna freeze this apple. And there we go. Love the draft's power to just give a pet some health and attack. Oh, that deer. That deer might be a problem. Okay, what can we do with these? Nothing. Give me that. Throw. I'll give that to you. I'll freeze both of these. Okay. Let's see how we do now. Still not ideal, but could be worse. Bright dumplings. Okay, the whale is the sheep. Okay, this is a mild summoning bell that I'm not against. It's not great, but it's also not bad. Okay, I'll 
Overexcited rascals, broken bludgers. Let's do the overexcited legends. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Upside down submarines. Hmm. Well, that was mildly terrible. That was terribly terrible. Once again, we lose round one. This is not going to be... For a summoning build, I'm not getting any summoning. We need crickets. Lots and lots of crickets. Okay, when nope, it's gonna be a draw. So close. Salty personalities. for a blowfish build simply because I got that blowfish. Right now I'm not getting the things that I need for a summon build as much as I would like to. Of course, now I get something to summon. So I'll get you, and I'll sell you, and I'll get you, and we're gonna swap places. I'll also get another fish. Oh, oh. Freeze that horse, and end the turn. Set of legends versus the low key bludgers. Hey, that amounted to nothing. No one should have got one of the fish. Fish can be extremely deadly in this game. Alright, we win. First victory. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We are going to let's get the 
little bit of a fish for another poor fish. And we will roll, save our poor fish, roll again. Okay. So what we want for a bluefish build is to get one more hedgehog and one more blowfish. Now we have another blowfish, but it all depends on if we can get that other hedgehog. Then we just have to upgrade the blowfish as much as possible, make them as endurable as possible, and we should win. Okay, here we go. So when the hedgehog dies, it does two damage to everything and everybody. And then the blowfish do two damage to random pets. So, there we go. And that's going to push a bunch of it, which means that we just won. There we go. <sighs> Hedgehog blowfish are quite incredible. And also incredibly mean. <laughs> okay, so at this point, I would say that we are going to roll. And roll again. Alright, let's see here. I want to sell you for this blowfish. I want to give this blowfish the onion. I want to roll the freeze that. And we're going to unfreeze that. Roll. Roll. Okay. Not ideal, but also not that bad. Let's see what this little hedgehog can do. Hedgehog is down. There we go, we destroyed the creature. Now we're getting annihilated. That fish is going to be in there. Okay, the bulb packages are all done to you. Okay, we've got two more rounds, two more rounds, and then we will officially be out of the game. I'm gonna give you this. I'm gonna roll. Give you this. Roll again. One more roll. Okay. So if I sell this horse I would have enough to buy one of these creatures. But, none of these creatures are particularly good or helpful. Could gain an extra gold from selling the pig. I'm just going to roll and see what I get. Okay, I'm going to freeze you because I can have you gain the abilities of the hedgehog. Okay. End of turn. Overexcited Legends versus the Running Mammals. Hippopotamus, but I've never been able to figure out a decent build for it. Eventually I'll figure it out, but for now, I have no idea. We will definitely keep you, and we'll end the turn. 
Alright, here we go. So, because the parrot mimics whatever creature is in front of it, it now officially has the powers of the hedgehog. The huge writers. Okay, so that does hedgehog damage. Does. To be honest, I probably would do better with three hedgehogs and two uh, blowfish, but I don't know that for sure. Also, all of these are so low level and so low health and attack compared to what I'm going up against. Well, it's not too bad, but now they will completely destroy me. Alright, and that's the end of that. Well, that was fun. Alright, Gideon, thank you for joining me this session. We'll be doing Super Auto Pets again this week, and next week we'll probably have something different. Thank you, and have a wonderful day. <laughs>